wake-up call DT.com. Coach, we heard this morning from the commissioner that with the expansion and adding SMU as well as Cal and Stanford to 18, we could live in a world where the ACC tournament doesn't have all schools competing. What are your thoughts? Yeah, you know, I think they speculate um, to try to figure out what's the best thing to do. You know, what I've heard was that it may be 16 teams out of the 18 playing in the ACC tournament. Um, you know, there's a model where there'll be all 18 teams playing. So um, I don't have a, a major thought on that yet. I have talked to my AD, Blake James, about it. But I think it's speculation right now. I think there'll be more serious conversations about that at some point in the near future. Coach, in these couple seasons that you've been at Boston College, we've seen some improvement with a few more wins last season than the season before. How do you measure success beyond the win-loss column? I mean, to, to be honest with you, uh, success to me is our players growing as people. Uh, you know, working towards getting a degree, uh, making a positive impact on the campus and the community, you know, being great teammates, uh, giving good energy and good effort every day, you know, eliminating distractions. I mean, I think if you do all of those things, you're going to win. And so that's just my experience. I mean, so we actually are trying to do all those things. And I think winning is a means to an end. Uh, I'm excited that we have graduated our players. Everybody who's got to this senior year in the last couple of years have graduated. They won't know how important that is until they're 30. Uh, Quentin Post has graduated. James Zachary's on track. So that's success, you know, this, this uh, improving, uh, being an everyday guy, being great teammates. Um, the, winning will, the winning will find us uh, if, we, if we're doing the right things.